After 26 years, cleanup efforts at Donna Lake are underway. According to the TCEQ website, the Remedial Action Plan, or cleanup plan, started this month. Channel 5's Cecilia Gutierrez spoke to a business owner who hopes the lake returns to the way it once was. According to the TCEQ, remedial action started earlier this month. Remedial action involves the construction or implementation of Superfund site cleanup. Roberto Molina paints a different picture of Donna Lake than what you see here. There was a lot of trees. There was a lot of traffic. People would barbecue there. Uh, you, would, you could go in on a Sunday or, or maybe 3 o'clock and stay there till 9, 9.30 and do some fishing. You know, you, you can even take your boat. Caution signs lined on the lake today, warning fishermen of the dangers in the water. Uh, there used to be a lot of people fishing and having a good time. Mm. The, all of a sudden, it just started to decay, I guess that would be the right word. Molina set up his businesses down the street from the lake in its prime, hoping to attract customers. That soon changed after the EPA first detected PCBs, a group of man-made chemicals known to cause cancer in the Donna Canal. Over the years, it's changed a lot. He says it was in the 90s when he first realized something was wrong in the water. One of my boys caught a, caught a, a catfish, which is very common in that lake. And uh, the fish had some, some red on, it, on its uh, mouth and some orange. And, uh, and then we just threw it back and started to wonder why, why it was like that. And the EPA discovered PCBs were found in the fish from the lake. Since then, several tests and fish removals have happened to try and rid the lake of contaminants and find the source. According to the EPA, a siphon is the source of the cancer-causing chemical that harms the fish. And I've noticed over the years they've been um, trying to clean it up or at least they, they show somebody's doing something about it. Now a remedial action plan underway to clean up the lake. This is the final action to clean the site completely and get rid of the source of contaminants. The TCEQ will replace the pathway of water from the canal into Donna Lake. They will also remove contaminated sediment and fish and build a new infrastructure. Molina hopes cleaning the lake will bring back business. It's going to take some time for the people to get back because of all the other uh, things that, are, that have happened there. Uh, it's not safe anymore. It really bring a lot of business back. And according to the TCEQ, the remedial action plan is set to wrap up in November 2020. In Donna, Cecilia Gutierrez, Channel 5 News at 6.